Drivers of forest clearing are those, <clears throat> those things that influence forests being cleared. So whether it's agricultural expansion, um, commodity uh, ag uh, ag agricultural expansion, or smallholder impacts. Uh, it can also be logging impacts. So those are the direct dr drivers of forest clearing. And then there are these un uh, an underlying um, things that drive forest clearing, which really include governance issues, um, macroeconomic issues, um, also local scale issues such as uh, po 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 poverty, um, other issues like that. So all of these forces conspire together to influence forest clearing. I think one of the most important issues for any country to think about is that by addressing the drivers of forest clearing, uh, this really lies at the heart of RED. Um, so this is the action that will um, directly result in emissions being reduced um, from forests. So this is what um, the, um, the, the ability to, um, to track um, changes in forest cover um, and then of course resulting in payments um, for red uh, that's really what drivers are about um, it's about those activities that will change uh, forests and the carbon stored in forests there are three things really to think about um, the first is that um, in the Cancun decision uh, Substa was asked to report back to the COP uh, at this COP on the dr drivers um, so there is a role really for uh, Substa to consider this um, and to report back to the COP there hasn't been enough time really to do so so I think that what the Substa needs is a bit more time uh, to, uh, to address this issue, to figure out how different countries are approaching it. Um, and I will say that I think um, the importance of a COP decision on dri drivers is very important. I think it will really si signal to those countries um, engaged in RED how important addressing dr drivers really is. Um, it's also really important when we look at specific agenda items such as reference emission le levels, MRV, um, specific aspects that countries are engaged in right now where they need to include driver information, they need to include assessments about driver activity, they need to in their policy responses be defining uh, what they can do. Um, so it's very um, it's very much a part of how countries um, are, are really going to shape what their approach to RED is. I think that countries are looking for ways in which um, they can have activities related to affecting dr drivers um, paid for. Um, <clears throat> and so I think that countries specifically want to see finance directed to um, addressing dr drivers. And I think that um, countries also understand, of course, that by affecting dr drivers, you know, that's, that's really where you're going to see any payments that are based on emissions being re re reduced. Um, that, you know, that the payments will be based on that reduction, on that change. So, um, so this is a very important issue.